Imagine a workplace shrouded in fear, where one wrong move spells disaster. Today, we explore the delicate balance of power and ethics in being an effective and good boss. Let's go. Pitfalls of poor leadership. First, micromanagement. As Timothy Ferris warns in The 4-Hour Workweek, this approach stifles innovation and demotivates employees. Next, a lack of empathy. Daniel Goleman's Emotional Intelligence emphasizes how vital empathy is for effective leadership. Finally, poor communication. Stephen R. Covey's The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People highlights how miscommunication can derail even the best strategies. Hallmarks of Effective Leadership Empowerment is key. Richard Branson's approach at Virgin Group shows the power of trusting employees to innovate. Active listening, as Sheryl Sandberg practices at Facebook, aligns with Simon Sinek's Leaders Eat Last philosophy of putting your team first. Clear communication, a la Steve Jobs, echoes Jim Collins' principles in Good to Great about setting clear visions. Lessons from history. Nelson Mandela's leadership, as described in his autobiography, Long Walk to Freedom, showcases the power of uniting through empathy. Similarly, Eleanor Roosevelt's role, highlighted in Blanche Wiesen Cook's biographies, exemplifies using communication for social change. Modern examples of good leadership. Satya Nadella's cultural transformation at Microsoft reflects concepts from Peter Drucker's management challenges for the 21st century, focusing on innovation and employee growth. Indra Nooyi's tenure at PepsiCo, aligning with Jim Collins's Built to Last, shows the importance of sustainability and long-term thinking and leadership. Secrets to being an exceptional boss. Beyond the foundational traits of great bosses, there are innovative strategies that can elevate your leadership to new heights. 1. Cultivating a culture of psychological safety, drawing inspiration from Amy Edmondson's concept in The Fearless Organization, create an environment where employees feel safe to voice their ideas and concerns. This means valuing diverse opinions, encouraging open dialogue, and treating mistakes as learning opportunities. For instance, Pixar's brain trust approach, as detailed in Ed Catmull's Creativity Inc., shows how fostering candid feedback and collective problem solving leads to extraordinary creativity and success. Two, embracing adaptive leadership. Adaptability is critical in today's fast-paced world. Heifetz and Linsky's Leadership on the Line advocates for adaptive leadership, where bosses are not just solution givers, but facilitators in navigating change. This involves being open to experimentation, learning from successes and failures alike, and encouraging the team to adapt and innovate. Consider how Reed Hastings transformed Netflix from a DVD rental service to a streaming giant, constantly adapting to technological advancements and changing consumer behaviors. Three, promoting wellness and work-life balance. In an era where employee burnout is a growing concern, prioritizing the mental and physical well-being of your team is crucial. This goes beyond offering benefits. It's about creating a culture that values balance, rest, and personal life. Take the example of Salesforce, where Mark Benioff implemented mindfulness zones and prioritized employee wellness, resulting in a more productive and happier workforce. Four. Championing social and environmental responsibility. Modern leaders are increasingly recognized for their role in driving social and environmental change. Align your leadership with the principles of corporate social responsibility, CSR, as demonstrated by Paul Polman during his tenure at Unilever. By integrating sustainability into business practices and encouraging social initiatives, you not only contribute to a better world, but also inspire your team with a sense of purpose and commitment. By integrating these advanced strategies into your leadership style, you not only stand out as a boss, but also pave the way for a more innovative, adaptable, and conscientious approach to business leadership. In conclusion, crafting your legacy, the art of empowering leadership. 
Effective leadership is a blend of historical wisdom and modern practices. Incorporate empowerment, active listening, clear communication, innovation, and continuous learning. Drawing from both past and present, you can forge a path as a respected and effective leader, navigating the labyrinth of leadership with confidence and skill.